Hi. Hey. How are you? Good. I'm Bob. Hi, Julie. I'm on the store on 59. Hey. I'm checking on her because... She's well connected with the medical field. Oh, really? Well, she just got out of nursing school. Really? I did, yeah. Nursing's a tough field right now. It is. What do you mean right now? Well, I mean, like, my stepfather, you know, five years ago, they gave away 300 scholarships and hired 180 of the candidates that they had. Uh, and last year, they gave out four scholarships and didn't hire any. Yeah. And they're cutting back a lot, and it's because of the scary health care bill that's mm. coming up, which, you know, requires nurses to uh, take community service hours and, and, and take pay cuts. And um, it's, a, it's a scary... Well, I talk to this guy. It's rough, yeah. <laughs> well, it is. It's, 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 it's secure in the sense that, like, it'll always be there. You know what I mean? And People will always be sick and dying, and just like their carpets dirt. will always be dirty. Sure. There's always going to be dirt in people's houses. There is. And, uh, well, for 100 years so far, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Um, but yeah, the medical field is a scary thing right now. Like, How long have you been doing this? 12 years. How did you get started doing this? I was actually in med school. Yeah. And uh, I answered an ad and uh, I went to work and they didn't tell me, they told me at first that I was just going to be showing people who already bought machines how to put it together. Yeah. And uh, the next thing you knew, like Monday morning, they dropped me off on the street corner with a machine and was like, call us when you get in. It's crazy. And I'm like, which one are you talking about? And they're like, no. So I finally got in and the people liked it and they bought it and um, like that first week, I sold like 12 machines. Yeah. And uh, I made almost $2,000. And yeah. like for a 17 year old, this is when I started school when I was 17, and it was like, that's a lot of money. That's yeah. a lot of money and, for a week. And well, well uh, and, and the Boy, thing is, like, it was a freakish week. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. You just, I guess I, it was my excitement. You were in med school when you were 17? You know, I was brand new. Yeah. yeah, I was pre med. Yeah. Like, okay. Like med school. Yeah. Um, but that's what I was I was planning to be. I wanted, right. to, I wanted to be a, a neurologist. It was like my lifelong dream. I started reading my mom's medical books when I was three. It's, it's stupid. But it's not too late. I'm this, 28. No, no. I'm, I'm very happy with what I do. Um, and, and the reason why is just I, I, I have really worked very hard. And I have three different stores. Um, and, and sales is a great uh, field to be in because you actually control your own Future. Right, 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 right. If, if, like at the hospital, my stepfather is a, in charge of the prison. There are bugs out there. And like <laughs> all of a sudden, a company takes over. Some new lady who's never worked there before starts working there, doesn't like him, and his job's threatened. He's been there 30 years. You know what I mean? It's just like. I'm, not your mom. I'm, I'm talking about my stepfather. But I'm just saying it's like there's no security there. You know what I mean? But yeah. most people think that job security is like 9 to 5 job, company's been there a long time, going to get a 401k. But the truth is, you never know what's going to happen tomorrow. But when you own your own business, you do. Mm -hmm. So, anyhow. I was an engineer for uh, 10 years. My father's an engineer. And I was a stockbroker for 30. Yeah? And, and but I you, control your own income. Right. You, I control where I live, how much I'm going to make. Because you're a stockbroker yeah. now? Yeah. Yeah. And and I, uh, I, the company can give me trouble, and I'll go somewhere else, and I'll take my dollars in the corner too. And you're independent, right? Self sufficient. Yeah. And, and that's hard to do. Sales is the best job. In the that's world that's hard to do in a corporate environment. You know what I mean? So that's why I like what I do. But I, I'd love to. My, like my, my uncle, he's the founder of WebMD, and, and he's got clients like uh, uh, Johnny Depp yeah, and got, Faith Hill. Yeah, I had a chance to talk so, about I'm sorry, I've been talking about everything else. Hey, I need like one more second. For real, just real quick. Don't worry about it. Just come over. <laughs> I really, look, I gotta get home. My little girl. Oh, you gotta get home. <laughs> come on. Really? <laughs> come on. I just had a brand new baby like five weeks ago, and this is not, it's way too late. Anyway, okay. what I want to say is, is this, is that I know you don't like making impulsive decisions, and, and, and I'd like you. I, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, but it wouldn't be fair for me or her if I didn't tell you this. Mm -hmm. Like, the only time that the girl gets credit mm -hmm. is when she's in the home. And she's like three sales away from winning her Cancun trip. Mm -hmm. She missed the Orlando trip by like two mm -hmm. sales. I'm doing everything I can to help her out. If, if like, if, if I gave you guys what she wanted to pay for, like if under a thousand dollars, would you take it and, and, and put it in your home? I mean, the, that the thing for under a thousand dollars? Not much under a thousand, but I'm telling you right now, you can go online, look on Amazon, look on eBay. You're not going to find it for any less than twelve hundred. It's not going to come with a shampoo, and it's not going to have right, a number. What not number? Me, including tax and all. Dad, you're being manipulated. Don't you do it. This no. is crazy. You've been mind washed for three hours. Don't do it. I've only been here for like 15 minutes. Don't sell me your shit. I understand what you're doing and you're good. Obviously, because he's a hard sell. You better not do it. 
You better not, Dad. Get this shit out of here. I'm sure it's a good vacuum, but this is crazy. This is crazy. I'm sure you're a nice guy. I am sure you're a nice guy. Is this not 480 plus tab? She's Dad, great. stop. I mean, she was in charge of my house. But, <laughs> you um, are so good. I'll give you that. I don't know where they found you, but they did good. And y'all must have a badass training program. You've obviously got some salesmen on your crew, but this is crazy. It's, the shit sells itself. It's <sighs> it hasn't, or it would have already. No. You've been in here three hours. I understand what you're doing, well, and I just, new. it's got to well, end. Never it's got to go, Dad. But really. Well, but he hit me with a price I'd pay for a curve. All right, well then, all right, well then, go ahead. If you, that's what he's, you're gonna pay nine hundred dollars for that. You then almost got a divorce over this vacuum. This thing? Yes. Do you remember that? You remember the Dyson fiasco? Mom wanted to buy it and you didn't want to buy it, and it was the hugest deal when I was like fifteen. Do you remember that? Yeah, you took the one that I wanted. You had my canister, my Sears canister. But now it's all you, Dad. So you're good. Hey, go you, ahead. Do you want the Dyson? Um, it's kind of heavy. I don't like it. I like the one I have now. Has she pushed the curvy? <laughs> has she pushed the curvy? No, I'm not you know, pushing you really it. Think I shouldn't do this. No, it's up to you, Dad. I mean, it, it's totally up to you. What are you? How are you going to feel about this tomorrow? Oh, Dad. I cannot believe it. You, who is <laughs> so thrifty and doesn't really love vacuums, Mom's the one that loves vacuums. It's not about the vacuum; it's the box. Like, and, and really, I'm, I'm really being in all honesty. You can call me a great salesman. You can call me whatever you want, but. Like, I, in my hand to God, you can get online right now. You're not going to find the thing for cheaper than 1200 bucks, And it's mm -hmm. not going to come with a shampoo. It's not going to come with a lifetime warranty. It doesn't come with a service. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. And I'm Why telling, are you like, making her wait out there? She can't even know that I'm talking. Do you know what would happen if she knew that I said this kind of price? Every time she couldn't sell one, she'd be like, $9.90. <laughs> and, like, I'll go out of, I'll go out of business. <laughs> Uh, you keep, you just hang on to him right here. I'll be right here. He's going to go discuss this with the, with the mom. How old are you? 28. Are you? Yes. It's nice to meet you. You it's too. It's a pleasure. <laughs> Don't give me your <laughs> shit. What do you do? I'm, I'm going to be a nurse.